Hello, Retro Fitness family. My name is Elizabeth Makis, and today we are discussing everybody's best friend on a Monday morning, coffee. I feel like reviews have been pretty mixed lately on if caffeine is healthy or not for you. So I decided to consult with my source for all things medical, the Cleveland Clinic. So we all know that coffee contains caffeine, which is a natural stimulant that wakes us up. But as it turns out, coffee can do a lot more for us than that. It acts on your brain to improve mood, memory, reaction times, and overall mental function. One study also shows that caffeine can help improve your endurance and performance during exercise. Coffee is a great source of certain nutrients like B vitamins, potassium, and riboflavin, and it also contains a slew of antioxidants. We all know how important antioxidants are as they combat free radicals in the body, and free radicals cause diseases. The latest research is showing that it's not even the antioxidants that necessarily make coffee so beneficial. It's actually phenolic compounds that are within it. These compounds are found in plants and they help bolster your body's defense system. Studies have shown that regular coffee consumption can reduce your risk of developing Parkinson's, Alzheimer's, and type 2 diabetes. These studies also show that coffee drinkers may have a lower risk of developing liver cancer, colorectal cancer, and depression. Like all things, we wanna make sure that we consume coffee in moderation as having excessive amounts can mess with your sleep schedule and dehydrate you. All in all, I will say, is anyone ready to head over to Dunkin' Donuts? Because I know I am. Thank you for tuning in to today's nutrition tip and I will see you soon.